In the videos in this section, we'll go through the process of rendering a scene in Cinema 4D so that it can be viewed using the Gear Virtual Reality uh, headset. And we'll be rendering with Octane, of course. So for this video, I'm using the Cantina.C4D theme. The first thing I'm going to do is add a camera. So I'll choose Create Camera. Let's select the camera and move it towards the end of the bar so that we can be close to our friends at the bar. This little robot and this alien, his alien friend. So let's choose to use this camera. And I'm going to do a quick render using Octane. So I'll choose Octane Live Viewer Window and let's do a render. So, so far we're just using a standard thin lens camera. So we kind of zoomed in on the robot here. So let's zoom out just a little bit. Maybe something like that. The next thing I'm going to do is select the camera and choose tags, C4D, octane tags, octane camera tag. And I'll go down to the settings and I'm going to set the camera type from thin lens to panoramic. So now you can see the scene is being rendered as a spherical panoramic image. Now to improve the quality of the render, of course, we can go into the octane settings and in the kernel tab, let's set this to direct lighting. So it's a bit faster and we can increase the samples. So let's put this up to like 7,000 and then adjust the other settings as necessary to reduce the amount of noise that we see in the render. In the next video, we're going to take a look at how to set up the uh, panoramic camera uh, for the right type of camera, the stereo settings, as well as the resolution.